Y'all know the rest. He's your friendly announcer. And I got some serious news to pass on to everybody. But I'm going to stop right there because you know what? Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening to you. How you feel? Welcome to the mental house with me. Your host, Khadija. I, you know what? I had to do this uh, real quickly because I saw one of the most vile and despicable, repulsive videos by a black woman that um, who was so hypocritical that for any of you all who feel that this person is legitimately represents. Um, a smart black woman, I should say, when her whole shtick is a fraud. Here we have a woman. No, I'm not going to tell you just yet who it is. You can play guess who. Here we have a woman who sued, uh, put it, had a racial discrimination suit against the university or against some business or whatever, and won based on her color and being discriminated against it. They won the suit. This person was a Democrat and now they flipped the script. Did a 360 degree change. And now this person is saying there is no racism in America, the same thing that benefit her. There's no racism here. And she's turned to represent the Republican Party. For those of y'all who don't know who the hell I'm talking about, I'm talking about Joe. Black Klansman. Candace Owens. Candace Owens. I'm very um, sick and tired of them using her to further widen the gap and to pour gasoline in the flames of and sowing negative evil seeds in the minds of people when it comes to my people, black people. Okay, so that's first and foremost. Okay, so we know we all belong to the human family. Okay, but for you to do this specifically against black people, then let me say something to you specifically as a black person. When you come to the neighborhoods, you should be ostracized. When you go to the church, they should say, mm -mm, mm -mm, turn your back on them. We don't want her here. You need to be a person in America that's only comfortable with the people that you are working for. So when they drag you through the mud, when they get, when they have no more need for you, and they discard you like a dirty dish rag that you are, you'll be a person without a country. Because it's only then will you be able to repent and see all the damage that you're doing to your to 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 black people specifically and to the human family in general. And with that being said, Candace Owens, you need to have several, in the words of Tamar Braxton, have several got darn seats. <laughs>